Hello friends, welcome back. Hearty welcome to you. Let us look at this problem related to trigonometry 11th grade multiple and submultiple angles. We have been given secant 8a minus 1 by secant 4a minus 1. We have to prove that is equals to tan 8a divided by tan 2a. So we have here multiple angles of a that is 2a, 4a, 8a. Now, what are the formulas we are going to use? We will convert the left hand side into cos. Then we will have two formulas. One we have cos 2a is 1 minus 2 sin square a. That will give us 1 minus cos 2a equals to 2 sin square a. And another formula is sin 2a equals to 2 sin a cos a. Now, in the first step, we will convert the left hand side into cos. So, we will write down 1 divided by cos 8a minus 1 divided by 1 divided by cos 4a minus 1. Let us try to simplify that by taking LCM. We will have 1 minus cos 8a divided by cos 8a divided by 1 minus cos 4a divided by cos 4a which will be equals to 1 minus cos 8a. Before that let's just let's write down the formulas. We have 1 minus cos 8a equals to 2 sin square 4a. divided by cos 8a. In the denominator we will have 1 minus cos 4a which is 2 sin square 2a divided by cos 4a. So, what are the formulas we are using, using here? Let us note them down. We know 1 minus cos 2a is 2 sin square a. So, 1 minus cos 8a will be equals to 2 sin square 4a. Similarly, 1 minus cos 4a will be equals to 2 sin square 2a. Also, we know sin 2a is 2 sin a cos a. So, sin 4a will be equals to 2 sin 2a into cos 2a. Now, let us apply these formulas and go to the next step. In the next step, we will have 2 into sin 4a into sin 4a divided by cos 8a. Multiply that with, we will do the reciprocal now. So, once it goes from denominator to numerator, it will become cos 4a divided by 2 sin square 2a, which can be written as 2 sin 2a into sin 2a. Now, let us look at what we need to get from the right hand side. In the right hand side, we need a numerator tan 8a and we know tan 8a is sin 8a by cos 8a. So, can we get in the numerator sin 8a? Yes, we can do that because we have 2 sin 4a cos 4a which can be written as sin 8a. So, let us go ahead and write down sin 8a divided by cos 8a. So, we already got the numerator tan 8a. Only left out is in the denominator we have to get tan 2a. That means, that numerator sin 4a whatever we have, we have to convert that into lower level. That means, we will write it as sin 4a equals to 2 sin 2a into cos 2a. So, that we change the 4 to 2, so that we can get tan 8a by tan 2a divided by, in the denominator we will have 2 sin 2a into sin 2a. Now, we can cancel 2 sin 2a sin 2a left out is 
sin 8a by cos 8a which is tan 8a into cos 2a by sin 2a that is cot 2a but this is equals to tan 8a by tan 2a which is nothing but rhs what we need so we have used the formula 1 minus cos 2a is 2 sin square a and sin 2a equals to 2 sin a cos a appropriately at different levels and we simplified the problem converted 4a one time into 8a another time into 2a so that we can finally get tan 8a by tan 2a.